In this video, I will show you how to use Puppeteer as headless Chrome to capture a screen of web page. Before start, first, I will ask to chat GPT, what is the headless Chrome and what is headless Chrome function? Let's check it out. From chat GPT answers, we get Headless Chrome is a version of the Google Chrome web browser that operates without a graphical user interface or visible browser window. It's designed to run in the background, executing web-related tasks and rendering web pages just like a regular browser, but without displaying the content to a user. In this tutorial, I will use Headless Chrome for web page rendering. I will generate a web page screenshot without access the URL. For further information about Headless Chrome, we can search about it on Google. Okay, after understand about Headless Chrome. To capture a web page screenshot, I use Puppeteer as library. It can access a web page URL capture the screenshot, and save as image file. Puppeteer is a Node.js library which provides a high-level API to control Chrome over the DevTools protocol. Puppeteer runs in headless mode by default. For Puppeteer installation, please follow the instruction on the website. It required Node.js installation on your computer. You must install Node.js first, before install Puppeteer. After installing Node.js and Puppeteer, this is example of JavaScript code to capture a web page screenshot. For example, I will capture the web page google.com and save the screenshot image as capture.jpg file. To run this JavaScript, open command prompt and then run the JavaScript by typing node capture.js, then press enter. Wait several second until JavaScript generated the screenshot image. Then, we can check the result of the generated image. The generated image shows screenshot of google.image web page. Next, I will change the URL target, I change to leantool.com. Save the JavaScript, and run on command prompt. The capture.jpg will be overrided, and it shows screenshot image of leantool.com. In addition of using JavaScript, there is another way to capture screenshots, which is using Node-RED. In Node-RED we have to install additional modules. Click Manage Palette, on the Install tab, search the module with the keyword, Puppeteer. Find the module with name, Node-RED Contrib Puppeteer New. Then click Install. After installation of Puppeteer module, I will try to create simple flow to capture a web page screenshot, starting from inject node, then, search the Puppeteer nodes to add some Puppeteer nodes. Add launch node, connect to inject node, then add URL node, in this node, fill the URL full address including HTTPS. For example, HTTPS www.google.com. Then, add screenshot node to capture web page screenshot. To save generated image from screenshot node, I add write file node. Set the file name, I will save the file in download folder. And select action overwrite file then deploy the flow next
Now, test the flow by clicking inject node. Wait a few seconds, it is generating the screenshot image. When finished, we can check the result. Open the generated screenshot image in destination folder. In this video, we can capture web pages without having to access the web page using Puppeteer. Either using JavaScript or Node-RED. What can we use from this tutorial? The answer is in the next video, I will show you the follow-up from this Puppeteer function. Don't forget to subscribe, so you don't miss the next video. See you in my next video.